Now don't bring me the phone. Jimmy may look like an ordinary dog, but when he barks, people listen. And this has saved Cindy Martell's life. Jimmy is a seizure response dog, and Cindy has epilepsy. Jimmy changed my life because before I didn't know if I crossed the street, do I'm gonna fall and a car is gonna pass on me because it's not gonna see me. Once when she fell in winter, she almost froze to death. My life was always just like stuck in, like a cat who's in the cage. Cannot go out, cannot do nothing. Enter Lions and the Lions Foundation of Canada. Our mission is to train and provide dog guides to Canadians with physical and medical disabilities, and it's all at no cost to the clients. Getting puppies ready for the training center is one of the ways Lions support the foundation. We get the puppies when they're seven weeks old. Lion Harry Marison is fostering his 10th dog. We do the basic training to socialize them, and then when they're about a year old, they are called back to college. Lions also participate in fundraising. Lions all across Canada have walks to raise funds for the Dog Guide School. At approximately $25,000, the cost to train and place one dog is high. It includes months of training for the dog. The girl and a three-week training for the recipient at the center. The dogs are in training here at the school where they learn their formal obedience and skills like fetching things off the floor, opening and closing doors. Push, good girl. They can fetch items out of the fridge. The foundation trains dogs to assist people with vision and hearing loss, autism, physical disabilities, diabetes, and people with epilepsy like Cindy. If I tell him to go get the phone, he's gonna go get the phone because if I need to do the 911, something like that. But if Cindy has a seizure, he's gonna bark and bark and bark till somebody's gonna come. One of Jimmy's greatest gifts is his ability to anticipate Cindy's seizures. She do a nine seizure back to back. They take maybe two, three minutes. And because Jimmy bark first, I can do something for Cindy. But the situation has caused financial hardship for the couple. I lost my, my job uh, because of the epilepsy and my husband too because he needed to be with me. A news article about Cindy's financial challenges brought her story to the attention of local lions. And we decided that we would uh, pay for Jimmy's food. It's your favorite kind. And as lions, we're just doing what we swear we're going to do is to help the less fortunate. Now Cindy does what she can to raise awareness about epilepsy and dog guides. My husband sent up a Facebook page about the lion dogs, about the, the Caesar and things like that. She also participates in the fundraising walks and has appeared on numerous television shows, telling her story and spreading the word. The lion changed my life. I have Jimmy in December. He was the, the best gift of Christmas. It's a simulation. It's okay. Mommy's all right. See? Mommy's all right. <laughs>